Right. Let me just get like an action shot where I just turn and go, oh, hi there. Oh, didn't see you there. Good morning, welcome to another um, behind the scenes at a wedding. Um, in, there she is. Uh, in sort of North Wales area today. Um, usual script, 55 mil uh, on the A7S. I'm just gonna show you how I shoot today's wedding. I'm um, gonna go and get bride prep first of all. Um, and then the ceremony's all in one place, everything's here, so, so here we go. Where's the ceremony outside? Nice. Oh, nice. <coughs> Hi, Hi. I, Adam, videographer. Hello. All right, how are you doing? She in the hot seat. <laughs> Hello. 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 Hi. Where are you? Where are you? Thank you. Thank you. How are you doing? Good. Yeah, it seems very chill in there. Very nice. No running around here. I've got Stuart with me, uh, who I mentioned, so yeah, just sort of come say hello and then I'll just melt into the background a bit. Will do. Thank you. No, no, you're fine, don't worry. want to walk across this door frame now. Right, come on. I normally just film door frames like this and just hope that someone walks across. I'm gonna be stood here for ages, aren't I? There we go, there we go. Oh, photographer, nice. <laughs> Using the glass. Um, just, just using the glass, can we get a sort of interest in the foreground? Say again. Second, this is my back camera for the back of the aisle on a 24 mil wide angle, um, and I'm just going to put this slightly off centre because the bride's going to be walking down the middle of the aisle. So as soon as she's in, I will then reposition that. I'm going to have my stew, my second shooter, reposition that into the middle. So it's like a nice central 
composition. Um, and that's that done. Groom's mic'd up, the readings are mic'd up. I'm gonna be at the front with a with my other camera on the 55mm and that's the ceremony done. So this is gonna be a roundabout sort of just off to a off off centre slightly, pointed down the aisle, and then once she's in, I can move it into the middle. I normally have this quite low and just keep it low and point it sort of up, angle it up, but <laughs> which is how I'm going to do it. That's how I'm going to do it. I'm going to keep it at this sort of height, angled up. Fresh batteries in there. Nice one. Oh, that's a sign of our love for one another. And I will wear it with pride. And I will wear it with pride. Now and always. Now and always. So that's the ceremony over with. Um, yeah, you got that. Um, I need to remember to get the mic back off the groom. Um, but ceremony done, and it's just a case of getting some sort of B-roll of mingling and people having drinks and stuff now. So I'm going to switch back to my 55 handheld. Um, I think the photographer's doing some portraits and some group shots, so I might tag along and get bits of that as well. So that's the plan until the speech is at dinner. And then we'll go in and set up about 15 minutes before speeches. We'll go and set up for that, and then well from there. Nice and easy. That was the groom. Found the groom. Yeah, no, you're fine, don't worry. Oh, oh this grass stuff tickles. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. She realised I'm singing and I'm being my. Um, she realised the mic's going to pick me up singing. Hey. Frame. A frame within a frame. A metaphorical camera frame and a literal door frame. Well, it's quite nice. Right, so I just need a few. It's all right. You know, a mixture of like wide shots, mid-range shots, tight shots, guests interacting, mingling, etc. Plenty of the key people. Um, it's just important to make sure I get... the key people in, you know, bridal party, parents, grandparents. Groom's frame nicely there, try and get that. Nothing too fancy. Yeah. 
framing the green between those two shoulders there. Shut the people, get that. And then we go, whoop, and get a nice shot of the flowers. Oh, and the wasp. That was good timing. <laughs> Getting a bit of reflection here, yeah, too. Stills of the table settings, even though the candles aren't lit yet. I'll wait, I'll wait for candles. Burgers, uh... This is where just using having a wide open aperture and shallow depth of field just gives you loads of easy sort of scenery shots. Just get. Nice blurry bits of flowers and stuff, you know. I just need to get the photographer because I always like to film the photographer in this part just to splice it together so you know what's happening. They're having the photos taken. Here's the photographer. Part of the story, innit? Mm -hmm. Do 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 Always have a spare, fresh battery in your pocket. Very important. Yeah, of course I can. Yeah, no worries. Terry? Do you want to get this? They want in a picture. I'll, I'll let, her, let her do it. Yeah, let me. Got a better camera. I wanted the three of you in that one. So. <laughs> yeah, yeah, absolutely. Don't make a noise. Don't even realise I'm doing it. Kiss her, kiss her, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Really freaking. <laughs> <laughs> well, we were late coming down. It was like, well, I haven't called anyone in. Yeah. So I'm just putting my wide angle here. It's the side of the top table, just to pick up the um, bride and groom's reactions and, well, well, the top table's reactions to speeches. Um, so I'm going to have a wide angle here. And then this camera will be on a monopod and I'll just be picking up, like, the top half of the speaker from here to here. And then I'm going to have Stu on a, a third angle just as a backup. 
and that's it. Yeah, so I'll probably be stood sort of here to get the sound profile of. Do you want to be on my YouTube channel? No, no I do not. And then a comment about a resting lady's face. Uh, you, we all know the sentence, I don't like saying the word, but a resting lady's face. So that took Sarah back a bit and the conversation sort of ended there. So the guests have had their meal, the speeches are done, everyone's had their dinner, getting to that part of the day now where we're going to do some portrait stuff um, with the lights looking a bit nicer and then uh, first dance party etc. So I'm just going to get some scenery stuff of the venue now. Um, see what I can find. Oh, bees. case of finding some nice pretty ways to incorporate the building and the scenery and the surroundings which is quite farmy and barney and countrysidey lots of greenery I'm thinking I'm being uh, you know creative arty in the middle. Focus. You, you're ruining my shot, by the way. I'm, stop, I'm gonna film. I'm gonna film you filming me. Right. So they're gonna stand in the flowers. I'm gonna use the flowers on a wide aperture to try and get like some nice frame of them in the flowers and the colours, and it's all blurry and magical. That's the plan. Let's see. Right, I'm getting to the middle here. This is the frame. If you want to like bring your hands up and you can put them on his chest, so you can put them on his face, so you can do <laughs> Ah, that light is stunning. Do you want to stand here, Adam? Um, yeah, go on. Yeah, go on. Swap seat. Press your body together. Yeah, smush. Yeah, gonna... Is she ticklish? No! no. no <laughs> is John ticklish? John is. Oh, I might have a job. Oh, I'm him. <laughs> oh god, who is that? <laughs> Amy! I did not expect that. This is what happens. This is what photographer. Oh, sorry. Are you, no, you done in this position? I just wanted to get you same like cuddling my, as you were, but just twist sort of anti clockwise. A little bit, other way, sorry. This way, yeah. 
Just like that, yeah, perfect. Just gonna keep creeping closer until it gets really weird. <laughs> and slowly back away. Okay, good. Yeah. and get everyone, yeah, yeah, brilliant. Ah, mum, I found mum, do you need? Yeah, layers, and obviously. Nice work. Follow me, come over here. Off and spread out. And then, and then hold them up, sort of up rather than at us. I've got hairspray on. Um, and then just, just twirl them and look towards the couple, they're gonna come straight through the middle, so. Okay, are we ready? Oh, too far down here. Yeah, yeah, get, get yourself down the front. Do you want me down the front? Yeah, 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 go. So the couple have got it really. I always, I always make sure I've got a shot of it, and then I'll man the first dance with this one on the monopod. I'm not going to do any lighting or anything. I'll just expose with the ISO um, and just crank that up to a couple thousand. So I'm just setting this here to get the. Um, The, look, the letters in the background, quite nice, and the band. Um. Stu, just go and stand in the middle. I'll just use Stuart to get my focus. Point.
Right, so. Always my favourite weddings, the ones that have a sweetie cart at the end of them. So, we've wrapped up, we've, um, said goodbyes. Job done, nice wedding. Uh, so the um, what they booked today was like a, a feature film package. So it's like a 20 minute edited film, a five minute highlight film, ceremony speeches. So they had the works. Um, so you know, I'll be editing that and getting it over to them. The highlights film from today will be going up on the channel alongside this BTS. So you'll be able to see the finished product of you know everything that you've seen me doing today behind the scenes. Any questions about? Um, like kind of what I've done today um, or any comments then let, let me know below I've put all the full kit list of everything that I've done uh, shot with that's all in the description um, if you want to see more BTS videos then go over to the channel and subscribe and check out some of the other content and uh, thanks for watching that's a wrap to witness the high jump to take thee, Sarah, to be my lawful wedded wife. My one true love and the person who I share my life.